Hey, what's going on guys? It's Taj from Stack Trading and we are done with the first week of the small account challenge. This is day number five um, and we've completed the full week. Currently, um, today, I closed the day up um, a little above, uh, right around $190 on the day. So, pretty solid days. I didn't take a lot of trades today, um, but nonetheless, ended up being a really good day. We had some follow through uh, for the most part when it came specifically to AMC. So, before we get things started off, please make sure, as always, to subscribe to the channel like the video and turn on that notifications button so that you can be notified when we post these videos as well as um, uh, some of videos just like this as well as other educational content but with that being said let's get right into it um, today was a phenomenal day for me both on my main account and the small account um, for the small account challenge um, I opened today with only about $530 in, in buying power uh, due to the commissions that I've had throughout the week all of my losses have been through commissions. It's crazy um, And as you can see today, I closed the day out right around hundred and ninety dollars in profit But I had sixty seven dollars in commissions. So all in all I ended up today um, around hundred and twenty one dollars net so um, Not again pretty good, but obviously we need to you know, hopefully make a little more right Today, there weren't a lot of small cap uh, movers that really caught my eye. There was one with MOSY um, that I tried to play uh, a bull flag. I got stopped out break even on the first one. Then I bought uh, I bought back in on a mini pullback and then it just completely failed that. But I protected myself, only lost $14 on that play. But AMC was really the take, uh, take home for me. Um, I played this stock probably five or six different times. That's why my commissions are a little high. Um, so initially, I actually played the pre-market action here on this bull flag. I noticed during the pre-market session, um, there was a nice gap up along with some consolidation. So what I decided to do was right here at 1320, as it started to prove itself back up, uh, price action traded back up to the 8MA and the 20MA, I said, you know what, I'm down to give this a try because I think this is going to have a nice pop in the pre or if not during pre-market, definitely during the open. Um, we could see some quick action uh, to the upside um, as retail traders are getting in on the stock, right? People that can't access the stock during the pre-market, they'll be looking to get in right as the stock opens. Um, so because of that, I got in here, placed my stops right around here, around 1290. And before the market even opened, I was up nicely on the trade. I only took about, I think I took about 200 shares um, and I was up pretty nicely on it. Rallied as high as around uh, 1350. And then right at the open, I'm um, sorry, right before the open, it shot up to 1370 and then had a yank. I'm not going to lie. I had a yank. Um, I did have my stops right at right around break even. And then the stock just ripped. I played it not only on this account. I played it on my main account as well. I, I ended up doing really good on my main account on this trade. And I decided to um, sell my position. Uh, right up here, right up here around 1370. Um, I don't believe I sold. Did I sell uh, on this one? Okay, on AMC, I got stopped out at 1332. So I didn't make a lot on the on the on the small account because you can see here AMC actually pulled back. But I took profits on my main account, so I I felt pretty satisfied. I probably should have taken profit. Um, on the initial pop here on the small account but my thinking was okay I secured what I really needed on my main account and the small account I need to be a little greedier right uh, because of the position that I'm in I need to really try to milk the trade and there was a good chance that AMC was actually gonna rally up to yesterday's highs which was around 1420 I believe uh, let me double check here uh, the high was yep exactly 1420 so uh, that was pretty much my target at least $14 um, on the initial pop so I decided to really give it a chance to to rally and because of that I did get stopped out um, for a small profit on on the initial pop but I said you know what let's see how AMC reacts right it was trading right here right around the uh, for some reason 200 is not here but this is actually the 200 MA right around here but also look at this green line here this is actually 
yesterday's closing price so because of that um i wanted to keep an eye on it to see how the stock would react here i knew there was going to be a lot of profit taking out of the gates um, once we got the initial pop so i wanted to see how it was going to really react once things started to settle in once all the action the buying frenzy came in as well as the profit taking frenzy came in and as you can see here we had some consolidation we have some basing action down here at 1275 double bottom form and then this rally happened once this rally happened i said you know what let me wait for an opportunity so i actually got in um, right around here uh, as it started to prove itself right around 1320 if I'm not mistaken um, I just I did decide to get in because of the bullish action that was happening and I was willing to add into the position if there was any type of pullback I, I added back into the position down here at 1312 actually got yeah I got initially filled at 1312 I added into the position at 1321 on this candlestick right here they hit a low of 1313 and then boom bull flag breakout i then placed my stops down here and this candlestick right here this was it as it shot up near 14 dollars i took my profit i uh i initially i took off half my position put the rest of the position using the bar by bar stops and ended up making a killing off of it again my average price after this was around 1316 after i did those um the initial position along with the ad it was around 13 16 13 17 ripped up near 14 bucks you know quick hundred dollars on the play we had another bull flag form here right off the a to may i decided to get back into it um actually got back into it quite a few times um during this chop here but a few times as we had the pop i you know i would sell half let the rest sit break even boom i would we would get another pop i would buy back at the a to may um and throw my stops at break even and you know get stopped out break even that happened about three times um throughout the duration of this consolidation here but as you can see here it ended up being a really excellent trade walked away with 135 dollars off of amc alone minus the commissions um so i'll take it i'll take it amc was really unable to break out of uh some resistance back here at 1450 um, we were able to clip 1433, but then as you, as you can see here, things really started to struggle. At the time when we were in on this bull flag, I'll be honest, I thought this thing was going to take off. I thought this is it. This is shooting up, you know, to those prior highs back in, uh, I think it was February of around $16, $17. This is going to run. We've got good volume. We've got a lot of hype. We're breaking out of yesterday's highs. This is it. And then it failed. But in those situations, you always have to make sure that you protect yourself. And that's exactly what we did. Throwing our stops at break even, practicing those strategies and not being too reckless with these trades, right? But taking the opportunity um, to go long when it presents itself. So all in all, a great, a great day. The past two days have been really good. Um, hopefully we can get a lot more momentum with small cap names. I know AMC has treated me very well the past few past couple of days, but small caps in general are still fairly slow right now um so let's see hopefully we can have some volatility pick back up in the small cap so we can send this small account to the moon right uh but that's gonna do it for me guys have a great weekend please make sure to subscribe to the channel hit that notifications button like the video and comment below comment which small caps you traded if you traded any how'd you trade amc if you traded it and where do you think it's uh, going from here. Is it done? Or is it possible, possibly a bull flag on the daily? Let's see. Next week is going to be a fun week, I think. We have large caps um, behaving pretty volatile um, in AMC as well. So let's see. Let's see how things play out. But like I said, enjoy the weekend, guys, and we will catch you next week. Peace.